but they won't make I talk, make I talk. If I talk now, people will begin to cry. Be careful what you wish for. Don't understand. Yo, welcome back, guys. I hope they know what they are doing. The man I know still trying to recover from an infection he got during installation in Turkey. Best of luck to you. So this is coming from a lady to Peter Okoye. So one of the P Square brother who shared a video of himself. Yes his hair installation so this was how he was looking before his adventure but the big question here is why is he doing this so sad guys true true they say this life not really balanced so he's doing this because of his hair loss peter okoye popularly known as mr p undergoes hair transplant after getting tired of seeing his twin brother plumb his long dreadlock so mr p of p square is undergoing his hair transplant in turkey so not knowing what he's getting himself into so yes of course all of these surgery and transplant of all that has their own side effect for sure so in his video i'm undergoing a transplant surgery just to look good for you guys ah <laughs> Oga, who send you for real? What do you think about this, guys? For me, this is really not necessary. And yes, money miss road. Hey, guys, Mr. P is here. As you all know, I'm here live in Istanbul, and I'm here with Dr. Veda, who is about to look after my hair for me. You guys know that I've been uncomfortable about it, but guess what? See the before and after of the magic these guys are about to do. I'm here at Med Hair. Let's do this. Hey, thank you. Hey guys, I'm here. Um, the extraction part is done. We have about 2,400. All right? Yes. And uh, it's time to eat my food. You can see the view. All right? I feel better 100%. So nothing to worry about. Hmm? That should look good for you guys. All right? Med care. Thank you very much. Food time. Moving on guys, so finally Junior Pope, the Nollywood actor who lost his life in River, yes, while shooting has been laid to rest. Yes, he has finally been buried and yes, may he so rest in peace. Don't leave me the ball, I got to the children, I'm going to rest them. I got to the children, I'm going to rest them. Bro, stop back! Oh Jesus, what is this? So it was a sad news for everyone. Yes, this really hits the world we had on how he struggled to survive. Yes, until he later gave up. So here are some highlights of the video from his burial ceremony. Don't forget to type RIP and yes in the comment section and don't forget to like this video. Oh, 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 oh. 
draw closer to God. He was on his knees in front of the Blessed Sacrament on several occasions, praying and interceding for God to help him in whatever distress he had. And I believe God heard that prayer. The bishop already told you how before he got into the boat, he was told to call my baby. And JP said, no, I'm a Christian, I'm not, I'm not going to do that. And yet he went into the boat and drowned. In my human thinking, I would say, why, Lord? Why? Why did you show yourself mighty and strong on behalf of my brother? But I know he did. Because John Paul is in heaven. He did not, he did not compromise the standards that my parents have taught us all these years, which is to worship God and have and believe and hope and love. And so Jay is the Lord. Thank you. 
наследует если пенсии до их позиции, я не думал, что не трезу, что не трезу, что не трезу, Please. 
I am going to do it. All the video men focus on me and get this message. Okay. Okay. But uh, his Holy Majesty, Jesus the legend of a person of the people, the top Hollywood actor, and also a royal father from Alhambra State. This is Fernando. Your Majesty, you are most welcome. Your Majesty, may you come down from forever. This is Fernando. You are most welcome. The only actor who happened to be an Igwe of a kingdom <laughs> in Nanambra State. Okay. This is Fernando. You are most welcome. Choose him. The Royal Highness, who humble himself to be an actor. What, what a gift, what a creative nature. Thank you. We are going to allow permit one of our own so that we will hear her voice. Jesus power. The magic man. DJ. At the same time, we have in the house uh, a top Hollywood actor, Masmito Chendo. That come on this week today, no week, on the Manasseh. Masmit, Sungu, you are most welcome. Thank you for being part of today's event. Welcome, you are welcome. Uh, uh, DJ One Watch, thank you very much for what I will do here. Michael Tooks, we'll get your voice. Jesus Christ, we can hear you. I just uh, said, uh, thank you. Please, we are inviting. DJ one love all the way from Afro Media Moa. If any of this appointment, they don't. And the Thomas, the Thomas of the Fight Commission, that you have to stay there, Thomas, to the family of all the world. These are the members of uh, Five Star Records, and uh, for our interest, he has been a uh, part of uh, Let's Brother, your brother, Jiyoko. and he has been a uh, part of the family. He's not, he's not a friend, he's a, he's a family member. From the church standing up to this moment, he uh, has been with us. Since yesterday, since yesterday, he came to Enugu, John Gosson. We lost a brother. Please, uh, uh, okay, um, first of all, I want to say, may his gentle soul rest in proper peace. 
And um, on behalf of me and my brother, and our friends, a lot of us are here. I want to say so sorry to the family. Juno Pope is a blessing to this generation. Juno Pope is a loving guy. Juno Pope is somebody that we will never forget in this generation. Somebody that is contented with whatever he has. We fell in love with him. Each time he sees me and my brother, some of us, they call us blood. My blood. My blood. You know, so it was a shocking story when we heard we lost him. And this is, I have a message for everybody here. As we are all leaving today, make sure you touch a life before leaving. It's very important. Some of us are taking this for granted. When we lost this young man, a lot of people did a lot of messy things. But I want to say this with this opportunity. Let us remember our own self if we are in the shoes. But thank you to everybody that has shown love and support in any little way. And for the family, um, me and my brother, my brother is the godfather of the first son. And um, this friendship and union we have with Juno Pope this time today, it's been a long time. And when this happened, my brother said to me, we are going to take up uh, the three kids and make sure we take care of them till they grow. We can't do that without the support of the family or encouragement of the family. So we are saying it openly to the family that we are open and ready to support the big kids so they grow to any level they can take care of themselves. As far as food, clothes, school, anything, holidays concerned, we will do it. We are not doing it to show off. We are doing it because of the last comment our friend said. Now only me, my mama born. I have three children, yeah. and I'm not going to them. Those words can never leave my heart. And we took upon ourselves that we are going to support the family to train these children. May God bless all of you for coming out and may his gentle soul rest in perfect peace. Dr. E! Like you said, your brother. My brother, I know my brother. You should call me blood brother. I know how close you guys were. I know you and uh, the Godfather to his first son. So in that regard, killing the children is something we raise, which, which is something we've been thinking about as a family as, as well. We are ready to train the children as well. With your support. We're using this opportunity to announce and we're gonna put it out there. We are setting up a trust fund for those kids to ensure that they achieve the highest level of education that their father would have wanted them to achieve. So we are, we are going to do it together with the support of any well-meaning person. Um, because this is a tragedy that happened to all of us. So it's a tragedy to the youth of Nigeria. It's a huge loss. It's a statement of the environment we live in. And if, we, you know, if we don't start from today to make changes, more junior homes will happen, more deaths, unnecessary deaths will happen. So we thank you for coming, we thank you for coming to condo with us, to commiserate with us. Okay, people are happy to receive you. You're welcome.